looking at the 2020 season, um, it left a little bit of a, a bitter taste in some of our mouths. Um, I can speak for, for many, um, but we were able to, you know, do some special things this season. Um, obviously, it's the unknown of what could have happened last year. But like uh, my teammates have said, there was a lot of unknown this year. So you can't take any day for granted. And um, just very, very fortunate and uh, very proud of the group that we have that we're able to complete something like this and, uh, you know, accomplish part of the mission. We're not done yet. It's pretty funny, actually. After the game, um, I was talking to coach and he said, congratulations on your individual accomplishments. And I was like, what did I win? I was like, I, I, I didn't I didn't really know. And he said, congrats on 100 points. And I was just, you know, it was, it was pretty cool. Um, you know, it's always great um, when something like that happens in your career, when you work pretty hard um, to get to that. But, you know, we have bigger things um, than individual stats. And uh, speaking for a lot of guys, I think we all feel the same ways. Our goal is to win a championship. Our goal is to never lose a game, um, you know, and just compete with each other and, you know, go for greatness. So, um, you know, I'm excited. Cool opportunity. Um, but we've, we've got bigger and better things um, than the individual awards. You know, not being able to, you know, play alongside Lenfest, um, you know, as a, as a group of three on the attack, uh, me, Gavin, um, we're a little bit uh, devastated by not having him play. But once again, we've got such a good group of guys um, that there wasn't a doubt in our mind. If not, it was just added fuel to the fire. You know, it's just like, fine, we're not going to have Lenfest. You guys better get ready for the rest of us because that was the mentality on Friday. And it only kept, you know, fuel to the, fuel to the fire on Saturday. Um, and we came out a little bit slow on um, these past two playoff games. Uh, we started a little bit slow, but once we're playing fast, playing our game, um, we've got everyone c contributing. I mean, look, we had Jackson Whitlock, who had, I believe, three goals, a couple assists too. Um, Gavin doing his job, always getting uh, arguably the most points. Um, probably not arguably, but still, I mean, we've got guys like Mikey Claflin, Zach Mann, um, our transition guys like um, – Jack Riley and Luke Murphy. So the mindset was we trust our group. We've got a bunch of guys who can step up and make plays. Um, you know, once again, devastated that Lenfest wasn't um, on the field with us um, to play, but we've given them another game, another opportunity to be on the field with us. And that's, you know, the best feeling.